guys, it's Nika from the Challenger Learning Center, and today I'll be taking you through an engineering challenge to design a parachute. The goal for the parachute is for it to transport an object safely from the top of a stairwell to the ground, and ideally we want to be moving at about 5 feet per second. In order to accomplish this, we're going to test out a bunch of different materials, and then use our problem solving skills to design the best parachute. To start, we'll need a piece of paper and a pen or a pencil or anything like that to sketch out our design. Once we get to the building, we'll need a variety of different materials to test as our parachutes. So we are going to have a plastic bag, tin foil, copy paper, tissue paper, anything of that sort. We'll also need um, an object to help test out our parachute. So I'm going to be using a plastic dinosaur, but you guys can use whatever kind of toy you want. Um, some string to attach our little dino to the parachute, um, and some tape and scissors and general stuff of that kind. To start, we're going to sketch out our design. So you can look up pictures of parachutes on the internet or in books, and you can use those to kind of help you formulate an idea on how you want your parachute to look. Once we have a design, we can start building. So for my first attempt, I'm going to be having four strings attach the parachute to the dyno, and I'm going to be using tissue paper as my parachute. Once we start building and testing, you might have to go through these steps a couple of times. At first, if it doesn't work, you can try using a different material to get it to work better. And this is how engineers solve problems. When it comes to building your parachute, be creative. And if at first something doesn't work, try and come up with some solutions that might fix the problem, or try using different materials to see if how that changes your parachute. By using a problem-solving approach and testing out your design multiple times, you can come up with the best parachute possible. Don't forget to test it out after you have a design that you think is pretty good. Um, and then make some changes if it doesn't work as well as you want it to. Hope you guys enjoyed this engineering challenge, and we can't wait to see you back at the Challenger Learning Center when we reopen.